what's up, Life Changes Kids? Welcome to CBA News. We are back with another edition of our weekly recap. Today is a very special day because, as you can see, we have the Beyonder here on set with us here at CBA News. Beyonder, how you doing? I am good. Hi, guys. Awesome, awesome. Guys, the Beyonder came in and told us that she wanted to come say hi to you guys and wanted to talk to you guys. So I was like, you know what? Why not? Let's bring her to the studio and we'll get her into the interview room and we'll just ask her a few questions. That way you guys can get to know her a little bit more. Um, but the Beyonder, really quick, um, right off the bat, I just want to ask you, where are you from exactly? So my planet's name is Solaris. Solaris. Okay. And like how many galaxies far away is that? Oh, that's like five million galaxies away. Wow, guys, five million galaxies away. That's crazy. And like how many people are approximately on that planet? Or like, are you people? No, oh. we're, we're aliens. Oh, how many are like on your planet? Um, I would say maybe like a thousand. A thousand? It's not that many. Whoa, this is interesting. This is, this is news to us, guys. This is news to us. All right, so then do you have like any siblings? Like are you, do you have any like kids? Do you have like any? I don't know, like, you tell me, like, who, who do you know? No, I'm not married, I oh. don't have kids, and I have one brother. One brother, and what's his name? His name is Beyondo. Beyondo, so you have the Beyonder and Beyondo, nice, okay. Is everybody's name like that, or it's no. just random? No, there's, like, other people. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. And uh, just, like, curious, I'm, like, just here looking at you now, like, I never really noticed these things on the top of your head. What is that? They're my antennas. They help me when I'm teleporting. They give me, like, the correct signal. Oh, okay. Yeah. That makes so much sense. Teleportation. That's right. I forgot. Mm -hmm. And then those help you, like, with the signal. Ah, oh, that's nice. I get it. I get it now. And then your glasses. Please tell us about those. Where would you get those from? So, it's actually a secret. I can't tell you. But there's only two people who have these glasses. So, it's me and my brother. Oh, so the Beyonder and the Beyondo. Mm -hmm. Nice. They kind of look Gucci. Are they, like, Gucci, Prada? Like... Sure. <laughs> sure. Oh, yeah, she can't tell us. She won't tell us. She won't tell us. Okay, so then so what are, like, some of the things that you eat on your planet? Like, what are, like, the types of food that you guys have? So we like to eat, like, lava rocks. Lava rocks. I don't know. They kind of, like, what you guys have on Earth. They're, like, pop rocks, but they're lava rocks. Interesting. Yeah. Interesting. Are they, like, different flavor lava rocks or, like, spicy, not spicy? They're not spicy, which is, you would think, because they're lava, hot, you know, but they're not spicy. They're actually super sour. Got Ooh, interesting. That's good. Mm -hmm. That's good to know. Remember that fact. Remember that fact. Well, um, I know we're, like, we're here just trying to get to know you a little bit more, but I also just want to hear a little bit more about, like, this past week, okay, so Strong Boy went missing, right? Mm -hmm. And Cloud Man was just there and he was a little bit angry and um, just kind of mad that the director, that director St Stone didn't choose him to go fight in one of the other battles and he was mad so he took Strong Boy mm -hmm. and he left and later on Strong Boy ended up going missing. Like, how did that make you feel? So, when Cloud Man was, you know, giving us attitude and then complaining that Derek only took Ava and me. That made me a little like annoyed, you know, because that wasn't very kind of him. He was not being good. But it made me super upset when um, when Strong Boy left because you know he's part of our team. He's our newest member, and yeah, when when he went missing, it was definitely really sad. And we wanted to work together to go save him. Yeah, and and I know like you guys kind of have no idea where he's at right now, and you. you haven't been able to figure out where he's at. Like, do you guys think you'll be able to find him? Like, are you a little bit worried about that? I mean, we are a little bit worried because we don't know what's happening, but we trust that God's gonna lead us and he's gonna show us the way. And yeah, we have faith that he's like gonna show up and we're gonna find him. Wow, that's awesome, that's awesome. So um, on top of like goodness and kindness, like those two stones, how important are those to the rest of the eternity stones? They are super important because without goodness, without kindness, everything would be bad and very wow. like bitter. And then yeah. good friends, they're kind. So that makes you feel like happy and loved and welcomed. Yeah. And if they're bitter, then it makes you feel better and like wow. not good. Gotcha, gotcha. Okay, wow. This is some this is some good stuff. You know, mm -hmm. I definitely, as I was watching, I'm sure you guys at home as you were watching and you saw Strong Boy was like missing and 
uh, Cloud Man, you're kind of probably like, Cloud Man, like, no, stick with your team. And it didn't happen. Like, I was at home and I was like, I'm until this day, like, till this moment right now, I'm still worried about Strong Boy. So I really do hope that you guys find him and that he comes back and he gets home safe. Um, like, really, what you guys need right now, you guys need Captain Strong Fist. I feel like that would be a huge help right now. And um, But I still believe that you guys can do it. I know that you guys got it. And, you know, I hope that the next two stones you guys are able to grab and you're able to get. Um, and, you know, Kronos, he's a tough guy. He's a tough guy. And I know you have experience with Kronos, and um, I know he came to your planet. Um, what, what ended up happening? Why, why did he come to your planet? So Kronos is evil. He is one of the most evil enemies out there. Like, I've never met anyone like him. And to make things worse, he has four kids that are also wow. evil. Yeah. So they all destroyed my planet, Solaris. And so I had to flee. Like, wow. Yeah, it was just so bad. So I went to Earth, and so that was a little bit better. But yeah. Wow. Well, let me just tell you, like the defenders are the best team to be around, and you are in good hands. So I hope that you guys are able to find what you're looking for, and you're able to get those Eternity Stones, and you guys are able to defeat Kronos um, because he is not a good guy. Um, he needs some goodness, and he needs some kindness. And the stones you would think would help him but I don't think that they are. But hopefully we'll find out what happens next. Um, and I wish you guys the best of luck. Tell the defenders I said hi. Tell everyone I said what's up. Tell Cloud Man especially. I love Cloud Man. By the way, Cloud Man is like one of my favorites. Um, but let Cloud Man know I'm going to send him a nice little gift as well. Um, but, yeah, that's it for today. Boys and girls, thank you for joining us on CBA News with the Beyonder. We are out.